Hello everyone, welcome to a foreigner farming in the Philippines. Tatai continues along on this rebuild of the caretaker's house here for Jen Jen and her boys. They've redone all this here. This was a seating area right here. Been taken out. A wall is going to be added. We just have a sand and plywood delivery. Uh, a new door is going to go in here. I don't know exactly what the plan is along this wall. I think they're going to put plywood or a mac in somewhere along in here and fix this up a little bit. As I understand it, the planned move-in is for tomorrow. And the uh, Petra's being noisy over there. And the cement work is going to commence uh, tomorrow, I think. I think that's what the plan is. Or the day after. Tatai still can't find the helper. And I haven't been able to get through here to work on the farm either. You know, it's Fiesta. Fiesta catches me by surprise every year. You'd think I'd be accustomed to it by now, being as this is my fifth year here, but yeah, you know, for, for some reason I keep thinking, well, Fiesta here in this in our barangay is only two days, and it was last Sunday and uh, last Sunday and Monday. But um, the month of May, all through Bahol, is Fiesta. So it's not just our barangay that has a Fiesta; it's all the barangays that have a Fiesta, and. Uh, Fiesta is a big thing in the Philippines, and so what happens is like, uh, you know, it's like the it's like the uh, the circuit of feasting. You just go. Uh, it's quite ordinary, and and the custom just uh, you know if you show up, if someone's ce celebrating Fiesta at their house, and you just show up, well, you're going to get fed. You're going to get fed a good meal. That's just the custom here. And so what some people do is, uh, you know, they've got families everywhere and friends everywhere, so they just go from house to house to house for weeks on end, um, filling up their bellies with uh, food and alcohol and having a good old time. But it makes it really hard to get any work done. We are so far behind in the fields now. Um, I'm going to need a crew of six here for about three weeks. To get all caught up and I don't know when that's gonna when we're gonna be able to make that happen because nobody at the moment wants to work I put in a request for hippie to ask three ladies to come and help her um, Consing's, Consing's husband is out of the hospital he got out of the hospital yesterday but I'm sure that Consing has you know, she hadn't been at home for close to two weeks. So I'm sure she's got some catching up to do. So whether or not she's going to work the rest of this week, I don't know. Ippy's been working. She's been the trooper by herself. I uh, don't know if Constance's going to work in the, any more this week or not. don't know when she's going to come back to work. I haven't talked to her. But hopefully uh, she'll come back tomorrow. If he couldn't find anyone to help her, Tatai can't find anyone to help him. I can't find any a, a crew. It's just, man, this is this Fiesta month is uh, not a lot of fun when you're trying to get stuff done. But Tatai's been soldiering on here by himself. Jen's been helping him some. I've been helping him some. But you can't really count what we're doing to help him. He's doing 95 percent of all this himself. Yeah, well, I helped Tatai knock these walls out. Some of these long boards were... takes two. I almost sunk my head on this. Oh, Tatai, God bless him. <laughs> five foot, five inch Filipinos don't seem to make 
six foot doors very often. This is starting to shape up nicely. That's I just hung up his tool belt and went up towards the house. He might be done for today. It's like 3.30. Still a lot left to do. I went and hustled up some leaves also for Petra and well, all the pigs. I got down two big leaves and gave them to them. They're not going to be fed for another hour or so. And they were squalling and complaining. There's still a lot of cleanup around here needs to get done. Jinjin Jin worked on cleaning this around here for two days, three days already, four days. Parts of parts of a week probably but there was a lot of clutter around here and this rebuilding this has made a lot more so I asked Tatai and uh, he, they're going to use this used a Mac in here and that's going to go on these walls this wall and Jin was talking yesterday that the the sink I think this, I don't know, I don't know if the sink's going to go on this wall or on this one over here, but she did say the cooking stove is going to go over there. And they've still got a Mackin to put up all along this here, so getting there, but still a lot left to be done. It's taken Top Tie an extra long time because he hasn't had any help really. I think Ray helped him parts of two days. He's gotten a lot done by himself. He's, the uh, stairs are going to go back here. He's going to replace, reuse those stairs. The, the, uh, the wood on that side needs to be replaced. And so he's going to put those back. I don't know if he's going to put that back before he redoes the cement or after but the quote unquote house turned out nice he's got all this completed now <coughs> as far as shelving and whatnot goes I have no idea what the what the plan is going to be but I would imagine he would put some in so he's probably going to be working on this Today's Wednesday, probably the rest of this week, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, especially if he can't get any help. When he starts the cement, I will help him. I'll help him. I'll, at least I can carry the buckets for him, help him mix it. Mixing, mixing it by hand is really hard, and it's really, really hard on one guy. So... I'll carve out some time when he's when he's ready to start this cement work. I'll I'll help him with that. It's just too much to ask for him ask him to do it all by himself. I certainly wouldn't want to. Thank you, everyone. Please like, comment, share, and subscribe.